All right, today I'm here at the Romaine Avenue crossing here in Romulus, Michigan. I figured I'd go ahead and give you guys a, a tour of this crossing because it's a little, little bit of a classic Norfolk Southern setup with some classic equipment still here. This is along the Norfolk Southern Detroit district. You're at milepost 19.31. You can hear my right, scanner going off. Might be something that might be going on the CSX, but anyways, we're gonna go ahead and get started with the south signal. This signal has a safe tran base. And then here is Norfolk Southern's emergency number. And then the dot number for this crossing is 477-307F. And then we have a 2000s uh, generation safe tran gate mechanism. All right, and the lights on this signal are three pairs of safe tran 12 by 20 inch incandescent lights, all sitting on safe tran light brackets. The side lights look a little goofy, but that's just because of how the uh, this intersection lines up, plus where the tracks are and where the signals are placed so they look a little goofy but you know they gotta do what they gotta do and then the bell on this signal is a general signals type 2 electronic bell i was able to verify what bells these uh, signals have uh 121 went through a little bit ago all right so that is your uh south signal we'll go ahead and cross the street and hit the north signal Doing this at night because the lighting at this crossing is actually pretty decent. That's why I came to this one and not Shook Road by the Diamond. The lighting's honestly better on this side. All right, and our north signal is somewhat similar to the first. This tank also has a safe tran uh, base. There's no folks Southern's emergency number once again. This also has a safe tran gate mechanism, except this is more of a uh, this is an early 1970s uh, generation. Let me go ahead and get you a little better light at it. All right, there we go. So again, this is a early 1970s uh, generation safe tran gate mechanism. You can tell because of the, the Louisville, Kentucky uh, engraving on it. All right, and then the lights on this signal are also three pairs of safe tran 12 by 20 inch incandescent lights, both sitting on, or all of them are sitting on safe tran light brackets. And the side lights on this one are also oriented kind of funny because we're also right at an intersection right here. It's the Romaine Avenue and Perry Street. All right, and then the bell on this signal is also a general signals type two electronic bell. And these two type twos, uh, one of them rings uh, slightly slower than the other one because uh, when they're activated, when 121 went through, uh, they sounded in unison and then they sounded off. So that means one of them, uh, they're not set to the same pace. But they are both type twos, I believe. All right, that's it for the signals. Let's go ahead and get you a look down the track. This is looking east towards uh, Shook Road and also Romulus Junction, where the CSX Saginaw sub crosses. And if you keep going further down, you'll hit Taylor and then eventually the NS Oakwood Yard in Detroit and also Melvindale a little bit. And then this is looking west. The next crossing is Osga Road, which you can't see at all, but uh, Osga Road is just down the street. And then if you keep on going further, you'll eventually hit uh, Belleville, Michigan. All right, that's gonna about do it here for the Romaine Avenue crossing. I get a nice little uh, 90s, 2000s, and 70s gate mechanism set up here. And this is looking down towards uh, Romulus, uh, downtown Wyandotte, or pff, Wyandotte, uh, Romulus. And if you keep on going, you'll eventually hit the guided road crossing, which is the CSX Saginaw sub. All right, everybody, thank you so much for watching. Again, this is Romaine Avenue here in Romulus, Michigan. Thanks for watching.